Alright, Valiant Blaze here, and uh, last we checked, we uh, came over here to Ryze's base, and now we're gonna we'll knock on Ryze's door, and hopefully he doesn't kill me, on sight. Hello. I brought sandwiches. You're definitely not that guy who smashed me over the head with a pipe earlier. That you would steal from me. Haven't I seen you somewhere before? No, I give you a choice. Uh, yeah. Very simple. Your right hand or your left. <laughs> oh. oh. Was that my left or your left? Ow. You have the look of the tower about you. What do you want? I'm here to make a deal. A deal. For fantasy, no doubt. Desperate times. Sure. And what do you offer in return? Hmm? Definitely not butt sex. Nope. Your no loyalty? services. Perhaps I should take both. Uh, I can't have my butt. He's one of ours. Do what he asks of you, and Rise will consider giving your people some fantasy. Understood? I don't seem to have a choice. Perceptive. Yep. <clears throat> That's pretty serious. Uh. Ah, great. All right, let's get in here and see what's going on. I met Rice, and Jade's right, he's a psychopath. He's also the GRE's rogue operative. Now I've got to cooperate with this piece of shit. Not only because of my mission, but also because he's got a ton of antizen stockpiled. Ah, no fun at all. I hate to be you, Crane, but then again, I kind of am. Hmm, tower trash, really. Whatever. Hello. Oh, you have weapons. Military rifle, huh? It's a military rifle. What do I have? Uh. I guess I could use that. Possibly. Yeah, I don't know. I have the cash for it. Yeah. A free slot for military rifle. Hold on one second, guys. I need this. I need this in my life. Let me get rid of the shield. Drop it. Ah, out of the way. Alright. There you go. I don't know who you are, and frankly, I don't give a shit. So stay out of my sight. Dude, I'm like all the way over here. There you are. Rai said you'd be coming by. I'm Karim. Crane. An American. I have an uncle there. Lives in Texas. You from Texas? You a cowboy? No. I'm from Chicago. Okay, Al Capone. We'll be in constant contact over the radio. That way I can make sure you get where you need to go. And where's that exactly? You're going to be climbing antenna towers and switching on shortwave radio modulators. Most of my men are too slow, too fat, or too drunk to climb a tower like that without killing themselves. If I do this, I'll get the answers in? That's between you and Rice. I know better than to speak for him. Just don't fail. He doesn't handle disappointment very well. It's nice to know. That's probably how you got that huge gash in your forehead. Yeah. Uh, I really wish I could throw some punches in here. Uh, I guess it ultimately just probably just getting just killed. Met a guy named Kareem. He's like Rice's major domo, I guess, or number one flunky at the very least. Kareem sent me to fix some antennas for Rice. Nothing better than being an errand boy. Let's go ahead and start this up. 
and it's still night time. Um, this should be fun. Let's do it. Get off me. No! No! Why are you choking me? Alright. I guess I gotta get up there. Ah, jeez. Uh, my grappling hook at. There we go. Made it. Yay. Crane. There he is. Report. Just met Rise. There's no question. That's Suleiman. Guy's a psychopath. He's gone from ruthless politician to fucking warlord. Is he aware of your affiliation with us? No. He thinks I'm just a guy from the tower. In fact, he's making me jump through hoops before he'll give me any antizen. Acknowledged. Continue to do as he asks. Remember, we need that file. Great. Crane out. Alright. <clears throat> You're a huge snitch, Crane. You know that? Whatever. Corporate lackey. You ready to do this? Okay. What exactly am I doing? Crane. Radio nice. communication has been pretty spotty in the quarantine. These modulators will help boost the signal so Rise can communicate with Outpost at the far reaches of town. Well, that's a benefit for everyone, not just Rise. Perhaps. But the Emperor must monitor his empire. <clears throat> well, I'm, I'm at the first antenna. If the power's not on, you'll have to turn it on. There'll be a switch in the small building at the antenna's base. Ah, doing this at night is gonna be a pain. Oh, jeez. Ugh, the frog. Because this fucked up infected motherfucker with guts hanging out of his mouth just spit a bunch of toxic snot at me. Not a bad reason. Ah, it's about the night at least. <coughs> Excuse me. Hopefully that kills him. Ah, dang it. I know that's gonna attract some pretty bad guys. Um, well, let me get this open before they show up. Come on, turn it up. The heck? Get out of my way. Freaking warrior. There. The power's fucking on. Good. Now head right. up to the top. Ah, I'm gonna have to climb this thing. Here we go. Uh, there's a ladder? Right. Ah. Yeah, there's a ladder. Sweet. But it only goes up one floor. And this one's broken. Ugh. That isn't too bad. Yeah, it's like a ladder every other floor. Okay. Yeah. Um. Climb that? Yeah. <coughs> uh, what are I doing now? Okay, here we go. Hooah! We're freaking ninja! Uh, I'm trying to hurry and climb this because I know this isn't a very exciting part for you guys watching, so. Well, for some of you, anyways. <clears throat> there we go, I made it. I think. Whoa! Huh? Whoa! Was that there the whole time? Woo! Huh. I got an idea. Uh. <laughs> ah, okay. <clears throat> oh shit, Kareem! Someone already scavenged this thing for parts. There's nothing up here to switch on. Fuck! I was afraid of that. All right, 
Head to the next antenna tower. It's not too far from there. Okay. Just use the zip line and head east. You'll see it. Uh, I guess it's east over there. Um, I don't grab onto this one. Okay, cool. Calabonga! Alright. <clears throat> We're close to an inactive safe zone. Oh. Yeah, I don't have time for all the that. Dream. What do I do if the second transmitter is trashed? The better question is, what will you do if you disappoint Rice? And the answer is probably, die horribly. Hmm, that's nice to know. Let me see. Is there a shortcut over here? Maybe, please? Shortcut? Shortcut? No, I'm gonna grab onto that. Ah, dang it. Now, how long am I gonna have to walk around here? Ah, uh, don't mind me, I'm just running around with a big, huge sword. Hey, guys. Ah! Yeah, let that let that remind you the night I killed your husband. All right, let me keep moving instead of slaughtering zombie families. Oh, that's right, I had the light on. Good track into that. Huh? Uh, I see some rising men on the map. Hello. Yep. <laughs> Get Daryl, homie. Hold on. Ah. Uh... Real quick, I really want that. Um, where's the other weapon I picked up earlier? Yeah, I'm gonna drop this and pick up this. All right, let's go. Later off camera, um, once I get to a safe zone, I'll go ahead and drop all this extra inventory I got on. Um, I just don't want to do it on camera again because. I, I'm trying to limit the amount Remo of the boringness in the video. And the fence is electrified. I think someone's inside. Mm. That will be Alexei, and probably his son Kristoff. I find them tiresome. Don't let them stand in your way. You've got to get inside and turn on the transmitter. <laughs> Alright. Just more climbing. Well, I can't. Ha! Seriously, I can't climb that? Okay, there we go. What the heck? I see. Man, whatever. That's so BS. <coughs> Excuse me. Mm. Alright, hold on. I can't, I can't climb this, apparently. Okay, no, I can't. I have this wall running thing, so it looks like I can climb it, but I'm not actually climbing, I'm just wall running. Um. That. There we go. Alright, um. Let me see. Where do I go from here? And. This one is gonna be a little bit harder to climb, I can tell we're out the gate. <sighs> Alright, well I'll be right back with this. Um, I'm gonna call it right here and I'll figure it out. Alright, see ya.